And we're back for more Hidden Expedition Smithsonian Hope Diamond. Let's get into this. Uh, what did we accomplish last episode? Well, we escaped the Castle Museum, and now we're in front of this sort of pretty museum. <laughs> uh, interesting. Oh, yeah, okay, so we have our uh, entrance card. And uh, I think we already got our Smithsonian symbol thingamajiggy. So let's go ahead and get inside. Oh, it actually sounded like a car when it opened. Ooh, elephant. Alright, I'll take that lovely puzzle piece. Let's see, so... I'm not sure if that's indicative of how much progress we've made. So we need that bulb. Ooh, nifty. Nifty, nifty, nifty. So, what else is in here? Key. Puzzle piece. We need one of those. Where's the clover? Get out of the way, get out of the way. Ah. Uh, no, that's not a clover, that's a club. Gloves, yay! Oh, actually, we do get the gloves. <laughs> I wasn't expecting to get gloves, but that's okay. Ooh, another one there. This glass is in desperate need of cleaning. Oh, garden gloves, I can go back outside. Oh, actually, that worked. You know, that button's all busted. Let's go. This is so cool. I assume that this is, uh, relatively accurate in terms of what's actually in the museum. So that's kind of neat. What the heck's going on over there? Someone forgot the wash behind the ears? Okay. <laughs> we have to, like, wash the elephant now, do we? I can't go further without some light, so that's what we need to fix this switch for, apparently. Maybe that's when we'll actually see the Smithsonian thingamajig. Okay, let's go out through here. Uh, wow, that's some pachyderm. I've never seen one at all. It would be a great place to hide something. Hint, hint. Nudge, nudge. So let's go back outside. I think we need to go into the bushes over here. Get the last piece, maybe. Oh, this is different. Got myself a parcel. Ooh, glass puzzle piece. Huh. Oh, I've even got myself some glue. So I still need the last piece, apparently. So let's see, what do we got for options here? Really? I don't actually have much to do? That can't be right. Let's see what the hint system tells us. Go there. How am I supposed to... Oh! No mystery about this. Good old tool will suffice. I have no tools. I got nothing. Well, how many cards have we not looked at? World's largest land mammal on display. Smithsonian outgrows the castle. Hmm. Cool. I wanted to actually check something. All the way to the beginning here. Aha! Okay, so that's what I was thinking. The Smithsonian was actually based on a person. <laughs> Neat. That's actually really cool. Alright, so I still need puzzle piece number four. And I don't know if it's behind the ear of this pachyderm or what's the story. And somehow I need to get in there as well. So it's telling me to go here. There's nothing to do in here. I need an Allen key to get in there. Maybe I can go to a different floor. 
Shoot, I forget if I pushed three or two last time. Well, we'll find out. Feels like I pushed two, yeah, definitely pushed two last time. Ooh, sparklies. That ladder will come in super handy. What else do we have in here that I want? Oh, wow, clever code. You know, take that, that'll be handy for cleaning things. Oh, neat. So, you know, a bunch of bars of soap. This makes me think of Fight Club, these bars of soap. <laughs> How many of you have seen that movie, Fight Club? Light bulbs, too, we need. So we need a couple scrub brushes. And a couple light bulbs. Oh, there's a scrub brush right there. So we need one more light bulb. Where are these scrub brushes? Can't tell if that's one there. No, shoot. Oh, look, I just saw that morph. I'm terrible at morphing. <laughs> terrible, I'd say. Okay, come on, where are the last of the scrub brushes? They've got to be in the cart, right? They're kind of yellowy green. If I lean in real close, I can probably see them. Oh, there's one. I swear that's one, but it's not. Aha! Collect three of the 17. No, I should have even looked. I didn't even know if that was actually lit up or not. Crud. Oh, and we've got to go through this, do we? Flask and a wallet. Wait, the cleaning lady found a wallet? <laughs> or, I shouldn't say lady, it could be cleaning man. The janitor, is that the right term? Phone. Golf ball, I saw you already. So we have a flask, a wallet, and a phone. There you go, found 100 objects. Now what would a flask be? That would be a flask. Wow, we are... I love the layers of uh, each of these hidden object puzzles. These are definitely puzzles because they have a whole variety of layers. It's clever. I don't think I've ever played a game with them. Normally they would make you go to it and then like 20 minutes later make you go back to it, but in this case you're basically at the scene and then you do it three times, which is kind of neat. Alright, so we got some glass cleaner apparently. Uh, so what is this going on here? Oh, okay. Oh look, it's Epix Cleaner. <laughs> that's funny, that's the game developer right there. There we go, we made ourselves some janitorial supplies. Let's go back down to here, clean that off there. Squish, squish, squish. Oh, I, love oh, I actually have to do it. Aha! Ooh, a code. We need that code. Oh, we have a ladder too. Back to the pachyderm. I assume we're gonna have to fix the button number zero at some point. We're gonna go clean the pachyderms here now. Ooh, I need you. I need you. Aha, more codes. Glue you up. Select the piece to swap it with one next to it, keep swapping till the pieces match the positions in the clues. Um, now we glue it. Super glue. Good thing we had that wrapped up in the parcel. What is that, anyways? Puzzle piece. This horse gets us. Ooh! Hey, hello, Alan Key. Welcome to the party. We gotta do Alan things here. Ooh, what the heck is that? Oh, wow, we gotta get gems now, too. 
Ah, uh, okay. Well, looks like I can still do something here. I'm already there. Of course I'm already here. Uh, uh go to? Where was the puzzle for? Oh, you know what? For the door, I bet. Or, I mean, this code here, I think, is for this door over here. Uh, isn't it? Forget now. No, it wasn't here, I don't think. Can I just skip down here somewhere? To the front entrance. What is back, anyways? Just curious. Oh, wow, I could actually go back here, huh? That's kind of neat. I guess if I miss anything... We're okay. We need to go forward here. Where does this puzzle piece go? I gotta keep an eye on if that changes... colors or shapes or something. Okay, it must be on the third floor then. Ah, here we are. Uh, move the tiles so that the symbols match the positions and the clues. Use the empty space. Uh, there we go. We're in! The Dr. Post's office. Ah, see? It did change. Look at that. So watch, let me see what happens now when I click it. 8 out of 20. Oh, that was a collector card. That's not what I was trying to go for. Oh, here it is here. Aha! Alright, alright, that's good. That helps me out actually quite a bit. Part of me expected this kind of cliche, but hey, if it works, it works. Dr. Post, it's of the utmost importance that you come to Antwerp. We believe we found the Hope Diamond's missing shards. You're the one person in the world who can verify that these are, in fact, the missing shards. Please come at once. We'll meet you at the hotel near the Diamond Exchange. Ah, that's the call I overheard. I'll take those, uh, papers. Ooh. Six gems. This is unprecedented. Inside the Hope Diamond is part of a constellation map. I wonder if the missing shards form the rest of it. Ooh, what's this all about? A gem display. Huh. Yeah, I don't have a clue what to do with that yet either. But we will figure it out. It's a UV light box, but I'll need a few more things before I can use it. Fair enough. What do we have in here? Ooh, stuffs. Four plus four? How am I supposed to get this bag open? I don't know where this anchor is. Oh, there it is. Oh, there we go. We need to use light switch. Where have you been? Let's have a look at this thing here. Oh no. <laughs> How am I supposed to open this without knowing the meaning of these symbols? Good question. Alright, well, let's go do light switch then. Because we can. Uh, that was on floor number two. So yeah, I must, it must be that during hidden object scenes it starts off as a different... Ah, uh, see, look, it's showing that we haven't got it yet. I assume that's also what it does for the morphing objects, too. Cute little... Um... I don't see it. Oh, there it is. Clever. This calls for a simple solution, like elbow the box to get it open. That would be simple. Whoa. This is neat. Got some lasers over there. I like lasers. How do I get this off of here? Oh, I see a tape. Ooh, we 
figured out the code. Cod. Creating synthetic something or other. I missed that. Creating synthetic diamonds. Ah. Okay, so we have that. I wonder if the... Oh. No, I wanted the... The National Gem and Mineral Collection. Wow. Hmm. Tavarium Blue Hope Diamond's predecessor. You know. So it's Triangle Circle Diamond. Discover the sequence of signs here in the gem room. I'm sure it's the key to something. I just have to figure out what. Triangle, circle, diamond. Triangle, circle, diamond. Okay, so how do I use it? Do I just... Why is it doing that? Unless it's opposite. Yes, it is opposite, of course. I love this ancient key. That's so cool. Okay, well, I think, well, before we get into this, we'll take a quick break, and we'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone.